Yo, what's up guys? I made a big mistake and I want to own up to it. Today guys, we're talking about my one video I posted. Actually, a couple videos. Uh, one about Uryu and one about uh, my tier list in general. So, uh, I originally said that Uryu was the biggest scam on um, uh, Anime Adventures. And I think I made a mistake there, guys. So let's go take a look at his starting stats, guys. 594.0 and 40. All right. Now, my first mistake here, guys, is um, uh, I wasn't looking at the evolved version, okay? Now, these stats aren't amazing, but uh, they're definitely not terrible. So I definitely think saying he was the biggest scam was a little bit not accurate. And again, he is a level one unit, so I made the mistake there. But even... I do believe his damage is a little bit low, but uh, yeah, when you evolve him, he's apparently actually pretty OP, so I made the mistake on that, guys. And that also trickled down into my tier list right here, guys. This one right here. So we're going to go take a look at my tier list, and I'm going to go tell you guys um, uh, the mistakes I made. So let's go take a look. Now, some of these were based on leak stats because not all the units dropped yet. So uh, we're going to go take a look here, guys, at the mistakes I made. And then we're going to also respond to your comments because I got a ton of comments on this video. So let's go do that, guys. Let's take care of business here. All right. So some things I messed up. Um, actually, some of this isn't too bad. All right. Now, I do believe the S tier is all still accurate. All these units are still S tier. However, um, I should have put Uryu instead of being in the D tier. Uryu should be S tier. Um, maybe A tier. Uh, the reason being, he is meta for the last map, but only the last map, guys. Only the last map. All right. Now, all the other units are still pretty decent as well. So, I think that's pretty uh, pretty accurate. Now, I would actually bump up Coyote Stark a little bit more. I really like his ability. And I believe Hog Eisen as well is has a time stop. So, I couldn't tell that from the leaked stats. Uh, so, I did make the mistake on this video. Um, he definitely is a meta unit. Ulakora a little bit on the edge and of course we figured out this guy actually is a buff unit so he is meta as well so I would move a few of these units up to the S tier and of course guys I messed up with the uh Uryu so let's go take a look at the comments guys and let's go respond all right all right here we go all right first we have Rukia so Rukia is a good freeze unit where did I put Rukia I put Rukia in the C tier I feel like that's accurate I feel like that's pretty that's not terrible maybe could have bumped up it is a legendary it doesn't do a lot of damage but rukia is a still solid unit i think that's that's a fair comment um all right um so yeah here we go this man legit put in the units that haven't released yet yeah i did make a little bit of an oopsie but i feel like i got it pretty correct um again i didn't know about all the abilities but we did have their damage stats i felt like i called that pretty much correct Again, though, I did mess up Coyote Stark. I did put him at the top of A tier, but I probably should have put him in S tier. All right. And again, I, we weren't sure about the Wolves thing either, which we found out later. All right. Here you go, guys. Tom Chi Allen. Are you in the D tier? A uh, low SPA? Yeah, we talked about that. All right. Yeah, again, guys, a lot of people here saying Uryu was actually good, and you're, you are correct, guys. I did mess up on that one here. Even Storm said it too. But yeah, we definitely should have put Uryu higher, but again, he's only good for the last map. So I'm not sure I'd give him S tier per se, but I'd give him an A tier, maybe low S. All right. Yeah, I did mess up on that one there. Uh, game needs hybrids. I don't think they have any hybrids yet. Well, actually, they kind of do. Technically, they do have hybrid units, so not quite accurate. Uryu D tier. Yeah, guys, a lot of people calling me out on Uryu. That's my biggest mistake here, unfortunately, that I made here. But uh, I feel like that is pretty accurate. Um, let's see if there's any other comments here. Oh, actually, this is a big one. I need to talk about this one, address this one here. This man makes me laugh so hardly. Like, why putting a unit that can do 12k damage for 6 seconds behind a unit that is only good of slows? Again, guys, I am basing this tier list on infinite mode going for the leaderboards, all right? I know a lot of people are trying to get on those boards. You guys can get those leaderboard units. Now, I, I don't give up. I don't care, man. If you're a solo player, this, this may not exactly be correct. Again, this is not for the best solo loadout. This is if you guys want to get those leaderboard units. I thought that was uh, pretty obvious, but apparently a lot of you guys don't want to get on the leaderboards. All right. Let's be serious. None of this is accurate. This is complete cap, man. Complete cap. 
this man even posts things that aren't real or true like saitama all right again saitama did not turn out to be true however i did put disclaimers etc in that video um i feel like if anybody watched the full video they would understand i have stopped posting those kind of videos i've been trying to stick to more accurate ones because the stuff people are sending my dms is usually wrong so i do appreciate that criticism and i have taken that into account you guys can tell i have not posted any of those videos in probably close to a month now um now the, uh, my other leaks were real though guys so uh, i do post a lot of real leaks unfortunately sometimes a fake leak uh slips through the cracks and i do apologize for that are you a stronger than rengoku yeah i did i should i did put a lot of disrespect on our use name that was not warranted there uh did bro call jotaro time stop guy yes i did jotaro has a time stop attack in this game and that's the only reason people use him so i feel like that's inaccurate but again it is jotaro i am actually watching that uh part three of jojo right now i don't know if i'm gonna continue watching it, guys it is getting a little more sus than among us Let's just say JoJo has a lot of sus scenes in it, and I don't know if they're appropriate or even legal. Like, I don't know, man. These JoJo be sus, bro. I can't believe they have that on, like, Netflix. Jeez, that's insane. Uh, bro really said Rukia is better than Grimjow. All right, okay. Now, this, this is for the slow reason, all right? So, I know a lot of people don't like the slow units, but they are actually sometimes meta, okay? So, I said Rukia was higher than Grimjow because Grimjow is a damage unit. Rukia is a slow unit. So you actually could theoretically use Rukia for the leaderboards or use Rukia to go higher in infinite. Again, if you're using legendaries for damage, all right, come on, okay? So I was basing this off of, I think the slow effect is better than Grimjow's low damage. But I do agree, Grimjow does have higher damage. I just was talking about uh, Rukia being better because you can stack her with other units using her buff. I don't think this is accurate, guys. I do understand that sometimes there may be a mistake in my tier list, and that's fair. And I do appreciate when you call it out, but, like, this kind of criticism is not real. This is just, like, hate, man. So I don't, like, I don't really care about those comments. But I do appreciate when you guys actually tell me, like, actually specific details about what's wrong in my list. Because then I can make it better. All right? Okay, not everybody's perfect. You know, I try to be close, but, again, I did drop the ball with Uryu. So I do apologize with that. Uh, man uses Firefox. Again, guys... I like Firefox. Opera GX is pretty good, too. They did sponsor me, so shout out to them a while back. This tier list was rushed. Yes, guys, I do try to be the first to get the tier list out. And unfortunately, there's a few little little hiccups. But I feel like it was overall pretty accurate. Again, if you stuck with the S tier and the A tier, besides Uryu, you couldn't go wrong. Um, there's some other issues here. Uh, Rukia is better than Dio, in my opinion. Honestly, this actually could be accurate. I think I might have messed up on this one. So I do need to do more testing with Rukia. I think they might have the same time stop. So, uh, yeah, I might actually start using Rukia instead. So this is something I do need to research. So shout out to official gaming, idiots. Uh, this is the worst tier list. Coyote is better than Arma. Uh, maybe, maybe. But, yeah, maybe on that one. Uh, that, that's I might agree because of the ability. So, yeah, that, that's fair. I, I should have put them both in S tier. Uh, he doesn't belong up there. Bro, Erwin belongs up there because of his damage buff. Duh. Oh, my gosh, guys. This is the kind of comments, man. Again, Erwin is there for his damage buff, okay? It's not for his damage, all right? Erwin's damage sucks. There for the damage buff. Come on, man. All right, bro. Come on. I, th I thought people would understand that, okay? Again, Erwin, stun units are there because you need them for leaderboards. Like, you need to get your damage buff, man. 25% more damage. You stack that on four people with four units apiece. We're talking a lot of value for that one slot, okay? All right, scam spot. Come on, guys. Come on. It's not that bad, guys. I'm not. It's not perfect, but it's not that bad. Oh my gosh. Dang, man, bro. Again, guys, if you're saying it's bad, that's fine. But please tell me what is wrong about it. All right. Hey, so I can fix it. All right. So I think I think we calculated. I think we did a pretty good job addressing everything here. And again, guys, I did take an L on the Uru call. Um, Uryu evolved was a lot better than I thought he was. So I do apologize for that. Hope you guys enjoyed the video. And yo, I do appreciate all your comments, guys. And I do try to read them all. So thank you guys so much for commenting. And thank you guys for helping on the tier list as well. I really appreciate all you guys' opinions. Um, but you know, some of them, I feel like sometimes it's a little bit of a confusion, okay? So I apologize for that. So I do hope you guys enjoyed this video. And I'll catch you on the next one. Peace out.